Hey everybody, we got something we're going to install today on the KTM, the 2017 KTM EXCF. This is it. It's from Northern Star Consulting. It is a fender eliminator kit. I haven't even opened it. I'm going to do a separate unboxing with this, but uh, I wanted to start this video just to show you that we're going to put a new fender eliminator on kit on here. And I ordered this offline after seeing a link on, you know, some random website somewhere and dealing with Paul, the guy that uh, builds these or, you know, manufactures them. Did a great job communicating, got it to me on time, and uh, we're going to install it today. So this should be cool. So what are we eliminating with our new eliminator kit? We are getting rid of this monstrosity here. I haven't taken off my bag yet, but I have taken off my license plate. And as you can see, this one's taped. When I bought this uh, used uh, the motorcycle, 2017 KTM, uh, this was already broken from the previous owner. As you can see, he just taped this. And honestly, who loves these things? These are huge. The motorcycle manufacturers still put them on. So I bought a Fender Eliminator kit off a of line, um, and we're going to install that today. So we're going to get rid of this uh, taped up monstrosity, and it'll replace this light these lights here and the uh, license plate bracket so it should be good to go after that so let's get started on that just to give you a closer look at this product I decided to take my camera off the upper view and show you the, the quality of this again the blinkers and the brake light is all integrated in here as well as the license plate bracket. And that's what it looks like from the side. Again, it has, uh, has the wiring right there that should connect directly to the wiring on the KTM. First thing we can do is take off this seat. This is an eight millimeter. side screw and with the seat push up a little pull back and the seat is off set that off to the side Okay, now we have to remove these two 8mm bolts right here. One does the electrical connection to the subframe, and then the other one just holds onto the subframe. So I'm going to remove both of those. So as you can see, we got the tail light assembly off, but the uh, electrical connections go inside there. This is what it looks like underneath. So I'm taking off these electrical connections here. I'm going to mark one. This one goes to blue. So there's a little blue piece on there. Wow, that's really tight in there. Oh, shoot. So this wiring goes up under here, goes through here, and it looks like it connects, let's see. And loops around 
Oh, here it is. It's just stuck in there. So this one here loops over here. And then the larger one connects right here near the battery. So I need to disconnect this one. Looks like that's the larger one. And then just connect the smaller one right here. So as you'll see, there's three connectors there. Red, green, and this one. I actually broke this one off. Uh, it's right in here. So that's what it looks like. I labeled this one 2, and this one's 2. Um, i got to get this connector off. So the main connection is here. And he has it wired, so there's two here. And the main there. But on the other motorcycle, or on the old one, there's three connections. So one's obviously red and blue. Where does the third one go to? connection here I had upside down so I just swapped it around and uh, that works As you can see, I have this lane here, and uh, the harness here uh, has one main, and then you can see I've labeled these left and right, uh, green and green and red. And these are all together, so there's all three here, um, and this is how it came. As you can see, my green and red on the main wiring harness from the uh, original comes back here. So what I'm going to do is reroute this up through here. I'll just take this off real quick. Take this wiring harness and just uh, pull it back through here. And then I'll wire it up under here instead of having this, this wire go back here to, to red and green where it went on the original. I'll just stuff it all up in here, and that should be good enough. And that goes through there. And how to route that? It's a mystery to me. Okay, we got everything back installed. Put all the bolts back on the bottom. Uh, I'm gonna put my bag back on, but I'm gonna get the uh, seat back on. Okay, we got the KTM all buttoned up and the new uh, Fender Eliminator kit on. As you can see, looks pretty nice. Quite different than the old one. Here's the old one for comparison. A lot larger. Quite a bit heavier uh, just holding this thing there's quite a bit difference between these two but there's the old one 
And here's the new one, all integrated, the turn signals and the, the uh, brake light all integrated into one, and a smaller uh, license bracket holder. And this is a 2017 EXCF KTM. Thanks for watching. I'll try to edit it all down. See ya.